Hey everyone, so this is the unboxing of my new laptop. It's an Acer Spin laptop. It has a touch screen and also has one of the newer i7s in it. Um, really nice GeForce processor. And it's gonna really help with my video editing. And I'll probably use this laptop to edit this video. Brand new. There's the box. And the, the last one I got, I got refurbished. It was a Lenovo Flex. And I really, that over there. I really loved the laptop. I loved the Lenovo Flex, but it crapped out on me. I bought it refurbished for like $200 less than the real price of like a new one, the exact same model. And uh, first, the SD card reader stopped working, and then, uh, which is the last thing that just happened that made me get a new laptop, is the the freaking charger port. It stopped working as well, and there's like no way to fix it without soldering it. So it's like, okay, this this laptop is stuck in my house. So it's going to be the studio computer now. Ooh, this is it, the Acer. Is it the Nitro? I don't know. Acer Spin, everyone. That is it. Uh, it should have some battery. So it has, I'll read you the specs. It has like a really nice GeForce. Supposedly for like a laptop, it's a really nice. Um, really nice uh, video card for a laptop, a little laptop. And I also like saw somewhere it possibly has like 10 hours of battery life, not while editing my videos of course, with a super strong video card, but let's see. So it's got an Intel Core i7, I'll put it up here, oops, camera's everywhere. It's got an i7-8550U, 15.6. 1080p screen, GeForce GTX 1050, and 8 gigabytes of RAM. I should probably have more, but screw it. And a terabyte hard drive. That's fine for me. Wi-Fi. Ooh, one month of Office 365. Exactly what I need. So let's um turn this bad boy on. Let's see what happens here. I'm gonna zoom into it too for you. Where's the power button? It's probably on the Lenovo. It's over here. And we've got an IPS display, front facing speakers, fingerprint reader, far field voice recognition, and Windows Inc. Hmm. I'm curious about what that, um, about what the, um, voice recognition is. That's like something I've wanted on a laptop. Another thing I saw about this laptop is it has, you can turn on what? Down. I saw that it has um, it li lights up the keys. It's got backlit keys, which is would be really nice. I think I'm gonna have to plug it in here. Sometimes laptops come with a little bit of battery, but I guess this is not the case right now. What kind of plug does it have? The plug is one of these, and I always have a replacement because like. I have one for my laptop bag and one for the house. So I don't have to like keep unplugging because that's really irritating. So I'll plug it in real fast. So there you've got an HD, the power, HDMI, USB-C, we'll see what that's useful for. And two USBs on this side, on the front, nothing. The bottom has a nice cooling grill there. And on this side, you've got, looks like the power button, a USB, an SD card slot, a headphone jack, and it looks like it, yeah, it's headphone and microphone jack. And then there's battery indicator and a light. I'm not sure what those are, but I'll look it up later. And here's the keyboard layout the spin. So it's got the shortcuts on its, on the top of the keyboard as well, which is cool. Let's get this thing plugged in. 
Let's see what time it is. So, um, I have to go to work. Yep, there's the backlit keyboard. That's awesome. So I'm actually gonna make this just an unboxing video. Um, all that comes in the box, of course, is a laptop and in the world. That's a touchpad sensor. Cool. I am and the power cable. That's what's in the box. So that's gonna turn on. I gotta go to work right now. Uh, peace out. Peace. Oh yeah, before I go, why don't I show you guys the, the spin part. So um, of course you have the normal, of course you have the normal laptop mode. Let me zoom out a little bit. Normal laptop mode. Then you have, you put it all the way flat, don't know what you do that for. There is this mode, and it'll switch the screen orientation to do that. Or you can just use it as a tablet. And it's very nice, and the keyboard on the back is deactivated. And it feels very nice and strong, too. This is feeling good. Hopefully I'll have better luck with it since it's a brand new laptop rather than a refurbished. I'm not going to do that again. Yeah, that was, but the thing is, yeah, I got a laptop, 600 bucks for the year, and I got a lot of work done with it, so can't say I'm totally, and I can still use it. It's just, I could probably make a better purchase. Now I just put it back, and it's really easy, nice hinges, very good hinges. I can't wait to see how it edits, benchmarks. I guess I'll do the benchmarks for you, that, that'll be another video. All right, thanks, y'all.